Now to the coronavirus. California is still under a COVID-19 related state of emergency, even as Los Angeles prepares to host the Super Bowl this weekend. At the state capitol today, some state lawmakers pushed for an end to the state of emergency declared by Governor Newsom back in March of 2020. 17's Ashley Zavala reports. It's been almost two years since Governor Gavin Newsom declared California's COVID-19 state of emergency. Between having one of the largest sporting events in the world in Los Angeles this weekend and the state moving away from some of its pandemic-related policies, Republican lawmakers say now is the time to drop the state of emergency. And this weekend, this coming weekend, we're going to be seeing scenes like this one. Assemblyman Kevin Kiley swapping out masks on the assembly floor Thursday in his in appeal to end California's state of emergency. The order gives Governor Gavin Newsom broad power to suspend and put in place new pandemic-related rules. California is hosting the actual Super Bowl during a state of emergency. A closer look at Kylie's mask shows the now infamous photo of the governor and former basketball star Magic Johnson smiling maskless at SoFi Stadium two weeks ago. End the emergency, end all restrictions, end all mandates. Let's let the people of California move on with their lives. Kylie was attempting to get the assembly to vote on ACR 46, a concurrent resolution to end the pandemic related state of emergency. His effort to just get it on the floor failed on a party line vote. SCR 5 would end the state of emergency. Meanwhile, State Senator Melissa Melendez tried to do the same in the Senate with similar legislation. The Thank you. House House Republican House Senator House Brian House Jones House rose House in support, House but then had his microphone cut House off. To debate with the minority leaders on the purpose of the action. So I support. The Democratic-dominated legislature siding with Newsom by keeping the order in place Thursday. In response to the push, Newsom's office said COVID is still very much with us, noting the state of emergency has allowed the administration to distribute tests, personal protective equipment, vaccines, and boost health care capacity amid the virus and its variant surges. In a statement, Governor Newsom's spokesperson called out Kylie and Republican Assembly Leader James Gallagher by name, saying, quote, elected officials should focus on what best serves their constituents and stop with the political theater. Apparently, they believe it would have been better to let Californians die and be turned away from care when hospitals reached capacity during the Omicron surge. But Republicans point to Democratic governors in states like New Jersey and Colorado that have dropped their public health emergency orders. Instead of deflecting, Governor, instead of trying to, you know, vilify myself and Mr. Kiley, do the right thing for your people and end this state of emergency that is clearly a farce at this point. The governor's office would not say when or at what point the governor might consider ending the state of emergency. At the state capitol, Ashley Zavala, 17 News.